Buenos dias. All right, so we're going to start off this morning with our story. Good morning. Good morning. Nothing. We're going to read about tadpoles by Betsy James. Remember we saw that cute little video on tadpoles? We're going to read about them now by Betsy James. Last fall, I got a little brother. All he could do was yell and smell and drool. Ma carried him everywhere. I had to walk. One afternoon in spring, we walked to the pond. Carry me, carry me, I said. But Ma said, sweetie, I have to carry Davy. And when we sat down, Davy got to sit in her lap. If we yelled, if we held very, if we held very still, frogs began to sing. I wadded to my rock and looked in the water. Something shiny floated in it, in the weeds. Look, I called, little balls of jelly. Those are eggs, said Ma. A mother frog laid them. They've got dots inside, I said. Those dots will grow legs and turn into frogs, said Ma. All animals look like dots when they're just beginning to grow. People do too. Was I a dot? I asked. Yes. When you were inside of me, then you grew legs and arms and turned into a baby and got born. Was Davy a dot? I asked. He was. The legs he grew don't work, I said. Wait and see, said Ma. He'll learn to walk. But I said, I'd rather have a frog than a brother. Ma smiled. Scoop up a few eggs then, she said. We'll take them home in a plastic bag and watch how they grow. But Molly, when they've turned into frogs, we'll have to bring them back to their pond, okay? Okay, I promised. When we walked back home, Ma carried Davy and I carried some eggs floating in pond water. I put them in my old fish bowl and watched them, but they didn't turn into frogs. They didn't do anything. After a week, I lifted Davy up to see. That's what you used to be, I told him, a dot. I looked again. Hey, I shouted, my dots are growing tails. Ma, come look. A frog's eggs has to return into, has to turn into a tadpole first, she said. That's a baby frog? The way Davy has to be a baby first and then a boy? Inside the jelly, my tadpoles wiggled. Soon, they wiggled themselves right out into the water. The jelly fell apart and the tadpoles swam around, Ma said. Their fruity gills are to breathe with un went under the water like fish. Every day I lifted Davy up to sea. I had to catch him first because he was learning to crawl. It's nice of you to show Davy your tadpole, said Ma. I said, I'm teaching him to be a boy instead of a baby. I brought my tadpoles fresh water and plants from the pond. They nibbled the green fuzzy algae that grew on the plants. They got bigger, their gills disappeared, and they came up to breathe the air. Two stumpy lumps grew next to their tails. That's where their legs will be, said Dad. On the 4th of July, we went camping all weekend. When we get home, my tadpoles had grown tiny back legs. They kicked like Davy, said Dad. All summer, my tadpoles swam and swam. Davy crawled and crawled. 
my tadpoles ate lettuce and even meat if I hung it in the water on a string. Davy ate fig newtons and rubbed them in my hair. Tad, he said, and tried to crawl up on my table. I caught him. My tadpole, I said. Pretty soon they'll grow front legs. They'll learn to jump. When they can jump, they'll be frogs, said Ma. Then we'll take them back to their pond. Not yet, I said. They're still babies. But next morning when I lifted Davy up, I saw my tadpoles were growing front legs. Summer was almost over. Davy could stand up. He could walk, but only if he held on to my fingers. He wanted to practice walking all the time. My tadpoles' tails disappeared. I put a rock in their bowl, and as their legs got stronger, they learned to crawl up onto it. They look like frogs now, I told Davy one morning, but they still can't jump. Ump, said Davy, he pointed. One little frog jumped right out of the fishbowl. Gently, Ma caught it. She covered the bowl with a cloth. All grown up, she said. No, I said. They're ready to be big frogs, said Ma. I don't care. I know you don't want to take them back, Molly, said Ma. Let's enjoy them today. Tomorrow we can walk to the pond. Walk, said Davy, and pulled up my fingers. Grow up, I said. Walk by yourself. I pulled my fingers away. He sat down on his bottom and cried. That night, Ma sat with me and patted my back. You love your froggies a lot, she said. But would a big frog be happy in a tiny fishbowl? We could get a great big fishbowl, I said. It wouldn't have trees and birds and dragonflies like their real homes said Ma, they need room to jump and lay more eggs, so there will be frogs next summer. But they're mine, I said. Are they, said Ma, or do they belong to themselves? Next morning, we took the path to the pond. Ma carried Davy. I carried my frogs. So carefully in a plastic bowl with a towel over it so they couldn't jump out. Ma put Davy down and held his hand. I stood on the rock with my bowl of frogs and cried. Molly, said Ma, it's time to let them go. I said, I don't want to. Davy let go of Ma's hand. Molly, walk, he said. He held out his arms to me all by himself. He wobbled down the shore, splashed through the water and crashed onto my legs. The bowl flew into the air all together. Davy and the frogs and I went sploosh. Ma splashed onto, into the pond and grabbed us both. Davy howled. I yelled. He made me drop my frogs. I know, said Ma. She held me tight, but look how well you taught him. He walked all by himself straight to you. Davy stopped howling. The pond was quiet. My frogs aren't singing, I said. Not till spring, said Ma. Will I hear them then? For sure. We started home. Carry me, I said. Davy can walk now. Could you take turns, said Ma? And that's what we did. The end. Buenos dias, Adisa. Sweetie Pie, how did you like the book, Adisa? What was your favorite part? Um, my favorite part was the little frog, the, the, the big one, the baby, and the mommy splash! In the water. Yes, they fell in the water. Good morning, morning Miss Delfina. Layla, good morning, Dr. Karen. Matthias, can you tell me your favorite part? Okay. Go. Say, your favorite part of the book. Mm -hmm. What do you like about the book? Tell her. 
What do you like about the book? Matias. What do you like? Do you like the little tadpoles? I see. Okay. You see how they turned from an egg to a tadpole, then to a frog? Did you like that part? I want you guys to also notice that while the tadpoles were transforming, so was Davy, right? Because when she first got the tadpoles, could Davy walk? Yeah. No. Mommy had Davy carried, right? Then she brought the tadpoles home and they started to get two lumps on the side where their legs would grow. But first they got their tail. Then Davy started to crawl, right? Then when the, when the legs finally came out, Davy was walking with the support of his sister Molly, who was holding her hand, right? And then when they got to the pond, the frogs had their legs, they were ready to be let go into the world. Davy walked all the way to Molly by himself. Yes. So Davy's legs transformed just like the life cycle of a tadpole had transformed. And I actually have watched some of you guys transform. When I first started teaching Matthias, Matthias was little, 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 little. And Matthias wore diapers and pull-ups. Now Matthias doesn't do that. Matthias is a bigger boy. He doesn't wear pull-ups. He uses the bathroom. He can run. Matthias couldn't run so easily. Now he can run without falling, right? Matthias can reach and grab higher things, right? Now let's talk about Adisa's transformation. Look how well Adisa speaks, right? Adisa speaks so well. Adisa walks very well. Adisa has a very great memory, right? Adisa knows all his shapes and Spanish words, right? You transformed. Your body and your brain transformed. They got bigger, okay? So now we're going to go into, uh, is there anything you would like to add, Dr. Karen? I think that we all have transformed. We transform every day. Um, different things about us change. Your hair got longer, Miss Whalen, from the time that I met you. <laughs> I put on a little bit of weight, so I transformed in a different way. So we're always transforming, which is a good thing. Um, as any living beings, whether they're animals or whether they're human beings, they're always changing, always changing. Absolutely. So let's go into our slideshow. So welcome to Young Minds in Motion, Zoom edition. So this month we are talking about transformation. What is transformation and how do things change? Many things around me change, like the seasons, right? There are many ways objects can change, right? Like when we turn a paper into an airplane or into a fortune teller. There are many kinds of, there are many kinds of changes in nature, Right? Like when the leaves, the trees on the leaves fall, they turn different colors, the grass, the flowers, that changes. Some things about me change. Like Dr. Karen said, my hair grew longer, she grew wider, and some things stay the same. Our names stay the same, right? What month are we in, Matthias? June, awesome job, I saw those lips moving. So yesterday, Mr. Adisa told us that it was Wednesday, June 17th. And Matthias helped us out with today's date. Can you help me out again, Matthias? If yesterday was Wednesday, what is today? What's today, Matthias? Thursday. Thursday. Good job. If yesterday was number 17, what number is today? What number, Matthias? Look. Eight. 18. Good job. Thank you, Matthias. So today 
is Thursday, June 18th. Adisa, can you help me out, sir? If today is Thursday, Thursday, what is tomorrow? You, now I'm muted. What, if today's Thursday, what's tomorrow? Um, you don't need to do Loud that. day. Exactly. Friday. Great yeah. job, sweetie pie. If today, good job. So if today is the 18th, 18th, 18, what number is tomorrow? 19? 19. Good, good job, my baby. Good job. All right, so help me out with the days of the week because you're a pro. You know this. Can you start with Sunday for me? Okay. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Awesome job. I'm going to go with Lisa. Matthias, can you help me out with the days of the week? Let's start with Sunday, okay? Sunday, Monday, mm -hmm. Tuesday, yeah. Monday, Wednesday, okay. yeah, baby, Wednesday, Wednesday. Oh. Mm -hmm. Thursday, Friday, Friday. Mm -hmm. and Saturday. Wait, Mara! is on a roll! Adisa is on a roll! Awesome job, guys. You guys are killing it. Now, who wants to help me out with the months of the year? Let me see. Raise your hand. Who wants to help me out? Thank you, Matthias. Go ahead. Let's start with January. January. March. February. February. Mm. March. March. Go ahead. April. May. June. Okay. July, June, July, after July, August, August. September, October, October, November, November, December. Great job, baby. You're doing so good. I still need you, okay? And Adisa, I love the way you're cheering on your friend Matthias. That makes me so happy to see you support and cheer on your friend. Good job, Adisa, okay? Uh, Matthias, I still need you. We're going to do our seasons, okay? So this season right here has snow falling down. There's a snowman. She has a hat. And then she has skis. Is it spring, autumn, summer, or winter? Winter. Winter. Good. Now let's go to this one. It's raining. She has on a raincoat. She has on rain boots. Is it spring, autumn, or summer? Spring. Good job. So right here, the sun is shining. They're on the beach building a sand castle wearing bathing suits. Is it <laughs> autumn or summer? Summer. Summer. Good job. And if I go to this one, what season is this with the long sleeve? The only one left that we didn't say. Awesome. Awesome. Good job, sweetie pie. Good job. Shapes. Matthias, I want you to help me with the guns, okay? We're going to do the guns together, all right? Matthias, this is a Pentagon. Pentagon. Can you trace it with your finger on the screen? A pentagon. A pentagon. Good job. This one right here is a hexagon. Can you say hexagon? Hexagon. Hexagon. What's the name of this right here? Look at the screen, Matthias. What's the name of this shape right here? 
Pentagon. Good job. We just said it. And what's the name of this one right here? The first one we said? Pentagon. Pentagon. Look at you. You did it all by yourself. All right. Hexagon. Pentagon. Pentagon. Hexagon. 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 Pentagon. Now we're going to go down, okay, Matthias? We're still working on the gons together, all right? This is an octagon. 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 Trace it with your finger. Octagon. Octagon. Trace it on the screen. Good job. So, Matthias, what's this one right here? Octagon. A pentagon, right? What did we say this one was right here? Hexagon. You got it. And what did we say this one was right here? The last one, N? It looks like a stop sign. It does look like a stop sign. It does. That's a great observation. And every time you see a stop sign, you can say that stop sign is an octagon. All right? The stop sign looks similar, but it's not the same, okay? Octagon. Octagon. Good job. Now let's go right here to the, uh, I'm going to go from uh, Matthias to Adisa. Ready, Adisa? Ready? Go ahead, Adisa. What shape is this right here? Round this or a diamond. Good. What shape is this right here? Da. What shape is this right here? What shape is this? Arrow to go this way or this way. Good job. What shape is this? Good. And what shape is this down here? Parallelogram. Matthias, what's the shape right here that Adisa told you? A parallelogram. Good job, guys. Give yourself a pat on the back. Because you guys are doing great. That's you, Mama. You ready to work out? Ready to work out? You ready to work out? Yes. You ready to get moving? Let's go. That's how you get more stronger. Matthias is ready. Adisa's getting ready. I'm going to give you guys a few more seconds. All right, so you guys could all take yourselves off a of mute. I want everyone to count. Remember, we are Young Minds in Motion, so we are proud. I want to hear everyone's proud voice, okay? Right, Adisa? We're proud. Yeah. Right, Matthias? We're proud. Yeah. Are we ready? Let's start with the jumping jacks and begin. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Awesome. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Awesome job, guys. Now we're going to do the windmills to the ground, okay? They look like this. Hand up, opposite hand to the foot. Awesome, Adisa. Awesome, awesome. All right? And from 20 to 40, begin. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. Awesome. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Mommy. Adisa, what exercise do you want to do next? Do you want to do the arms? Do you want to reach for the sky? Or do you want to get that car in gear and do some running in place? Running in place? Awesome. So from 40 to 60, 
I want everybody to put the key in the ignition. Turn the car on. Put those arms right next to you. And begin. 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, what? 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. Deep breath in. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. You don't have to go on circles while you're Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Matthias, what's the next exercise you want to do? Do you want to reach to the sky? Or do you want to do the arms? I want to do the run. We did the run. We want to reach for, you know what? Do you want to do the run again? Adisa, do you agree? Let's do it again. Then from, again. right, we'll do it again. Ready? So let's take the key. We park the car, let's put it back in the ignition. All right, let's turn the car on. Let's put our arms by our side. And begin. 60, 61, 62, 63, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Awesome. Adisa, pick your next workout. We can reach for the sky. We can do arms. What do we want to do? Push it up. Push-ups? Punching up. Punching up? All right, let's punch up then, okay? Go ahead, Adisa, take the way. And we got those arms ready. Remember to reach as high as you can and grab those stars and bring it down, okay? Are we ready? Are we set? Ready? Begin. 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Awesome! We did it! 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 We did it. Let's come back to our seats. <laughs> Deep breath in, deep breath out, deep breath in, deep breath out. Awesome. So we're going to go over our vocabulary words, all right? Keep yourselves off of mute because I want to hear your voices, okay? I'm going to say them and then you guys are going to repeat after me. Thumbs up. Are we ready? Yeah. Yeah. Let me see your thumbs, Matthias. Let me see your thumbs. Good. All right. Ready? Birth. 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 Butterfly. Caterpillar. Chrysalis. Cocoon. Cycle. Egg, entomologist, one more time, entomologist, larva, life cycle, metamorphosis, one more time, metamorphosis, pupa, Awesome. Let's go to slide. 
We're gonna learn some new sight words today. Let's thank Dr. Karen for this awesome, awesome video on sight words. Is there anything you wanna add, Dr. Karen? Can't hear you. I want them to look at the words that are on the screen. We're going to do it differently than we did yesterday. So this time the video is going to say the word. I want you to say the word after them. This, is, this one is a little bit more fun. Subscribe to our channel. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up for more. The, 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 the end. Of. 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 Good job, Adisa. Of. I want to I hear you. Matthias, can you unmute yourself? Block of ducks. And. 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 Ah. 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 Uh-oh. Two. 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 Yes, to Mars by car. <laughs> in. 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 Then in bed. Is. 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 Today is my birthday. Today is my birthday. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> you. 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 That. 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 This and that. This, this and that. And that. It. 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 Get it. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Four. 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 Thank you. No thank you for you. Was. 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 What was that? On. 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 Frogs on a log. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that frog. R. 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 In the end, King Ming's songs are too long. <laughs> Not. 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 Cat cannot. Ah! Ah! But. 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 Stork sees the corn. But not the horn. What? 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 All. 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 Today it will rain all day. <gasps> we. 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 We will win. We will win. There. 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 White whale there. White whale there. Can. 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 Cat can. An. 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 Just an X? Ah. Your. 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 Your, your pie on my tie? <clears throat> huh? Huh? There. 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 Bear boxes. 
there. Do. 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 Do fly by. <laughs> the end. The end. Subscribe to our channel. And if you enjoyed this video, I like give that a lot. For more. Adisa, for you more. did an amazing job. You Thank definitely you. did. Like that? So before we go into our yoga, I just want to take the time to review our Spanish words from the book that we read, I'm a Caterpillar. So when I give you new words, I make sure that you guys are pros and you guys are down packed with these words here, okay? You forgot to say Caterpillar in Spanish? You tell me, baby. How do you say it? Caterpillar? Mariposa. 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 That's butterfly and then caterpillar, aruga. 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 So when you say that word, think of think of the um the funny cartoon word. Aruga. Aruga. Good job. All right, so let's start with the color. Adisa, do you remember what color this is in Spanish? In Spanish, can you say it in Spanish? We did it this morning. Ah. 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 Ama. 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 Amarillo. 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 Great job, mom. Too. Amarillo. Amarillo. So today, when you guys look up at the sun, you can say, "Look, ma, the sun is amarillo." Right. Or I saw Matthias with the toy in his hand. You could say, Mommy, look, this has amarillo in it, right? This has yellow in it. Amarillo. Can we say it again? Amarillo. Awesome job. Matthias, let's put the toy down. And I want to hear you say amarillo. Amarillo. Good job. Now let's go to numeros. Numbers, okay? Can we put up our five friends? Can we put up our fists right here? That's right, Adisa. Good. Matthias, let me see your fist, honey, okay? Now we're going to count to five, not in English, but in Spanish, okay? Are we ready? Adisa, can you take yourself off a of mute, honey? Are you ready? No. Ready? No. Let's start from the beginning. You ready? No. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. And what's the new number, Disa? Cinco. Cinco. That's right. One more time, okay? This time, Adisa, I want you to lead the way, okay? Get ahead, Adisa, begin. Uno, dos, tres. Mato Cinco. Awesome job. And Adisa, what color is this right here? Hello? In Spanish. Um, can you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> Amarillo. Amarillo. Just like that. Amarillo. Okay? Let's yep. say it a couple times. Amarillo. 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 So what color is this, Adisa? Amarillo. Good. What color is this right here? Amarillo. And what color is this right here? Amarillo. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome job, baby. All right. So now let's go to our words. We learned cambiar. Cambiar. Can we say cambiar? Cambiar. 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 Which means change. To change, right? Change. Then we learned the word volar. Volar. Good job. And what's volar? Fly. To fly. Good job. Then we learned the word caminar. 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 
Walk. Coming. What is it, baby? Walk. To walk. Adisa, can you do me a favor? Can you caminar in a circle around your chair? Caminar. What does it mean? What does caminar mean? Um, circle? No, caminar means walk. Around your chair. So caminar around your chair. Great job, Adisa. Awesome. I'm super happy. All right. So now let's move into our yoga. We got super excited when we worked out. We got super excited with our Spanish words. Now let's namaste. Let's bring it in. And let's calm down. And let's do our yoga. I'm going to give you guys a minute so you guys can prepare. Matthias, baby, go ahead, get into your yoga space. See, I'm going to put you now. Hey, baby. Adisa's ready. Matthias, you need another minute? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Awesome. Now I'm going to press play and be begin. Hello.
So now let's review. We did story time. We did all about today. We did our days of the month of the year, our days of the week, our seasons, our shapes. We got fit. We counted to 100. We did vocabulary words. We reviewed Spanish. <gasps> we did sight words. And we even did goodbye yoga. You guys did an amazing job today. I am super duper proud. I hope you guys have a great, great day. Dr. Karen, is there anything you want to add? Have an amazing weekend. See you guys on Monday. All right. Adios. Mm -hmm.